Lyndon Simmons, gay legend. That is what people say when they mention <laughs> Lyndon Simmons. You came to the club in uh, on loan when Eddie Gray brought you here uh, in 1987. Uh, what was the what was the time like here? Fantastic. I thoroughly enjoyed it. I'd, I'd, I'd been at Leeds and I'd um, fortunately been in the first team. We had a few injuries and just needed to get out and play some games. So I uh, went down to Swansea and did them a favour for eight weeks with Terry Orrath, as I knew. And then Eddie Gray came in and brought me in and it was like the Ario Dini act, wasn't it? It was win seven out of ten or go out the league. And I think with the facilities and the structure behind the club in those days, I don't think they'd have got back. And that's me being honest. And you just said, as we were just talking before, that nobody thought that you could do that, do that as a you know, a chance. Fans or anything. I think they won four games all season, and I think I'm to win seven out of eleven or something like that was just what's going on here. And I can remember we went to Preston and won, and they were top of the league and won it by a street. Um, and then obviously the, the famous Stockport game, the last game of the season, where I had to win to stay up. I go and miss a penalty in the first half, which doesn't do anybody any favours. And then I managed to get the winner. So things changed. That's the only penalty I've ever missed in my career as well. So there you go. I think things are done for a reason. So 10 goals in 22 appearances for Dale yeah. that season. It could have been 11 then if you'd have got that penalty. Could have been <laughs> 11 then. Could have been a few more actually. I got two actually. The first game I played was Peterborough. I think it was a 3 0 win at home when I got two. So um, that set me off well. So today is quite interesting actually. Have you been back to Scotland, the Crown Oil Arena as it is now? Have you been back to Scotland? Yeah, I've been back a couple of times. I came back for the centenary years ago, um, which I was invited to and did a fans forum and things like that, which was great. Been back on a couple of occasions, watched you away on many of occasions when it's a bit warmer down south. <laughs> yeah, it's a day, it's, it's certainly a day for, uh, for, 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 for the northerners here today. It was snowing when I turned onto the M62 and I thought, do you know what, I'm back. <laughs> Um, and, and what's what's a place like nowadays in comparison oh, to when you were here? Unbelievable, completely different. Apart from behind the goals, <laughs> probably not a lot of difference. <laughs> yeah, not a lot of difference. Everything else is phenomenal. You know, you've got the boardroom, which I've been in to speak to the directors and that today, which is great. I've been and spoke to the trust, so I've gone and met some of the fans in the bar. Ah, listen, it's great. And anything I can do at any time for this club, I would do it because their memories were fantastic. And you're here uh, working today, you know, you know work for Queen's yeah, Park Rangers? Yeah, I work for Park Rangers. Um, I do a bit of recruitment and scouting and some opposition stuff and um, yeah, I'm on a spying mission today for something. So. We won't mention who? No. <laughs> Lyndon Simmons, thank you very much for speaking to My us. Pleasure. Cheers, thank you.